Lockbit is by far this summer's most prolific ransomware group, trailed by two offshoots of the Conti group. After a recent dip, ransomware attacks are back on the rise. According to data released by NCC Group, the resurgence is being led by old ransomware as a service, RAS, groups. With data gathered by actively monitoring the leak sites used by each ransomware group and scraping victim details as they are released, researchers have determined that Lockbit was by far the most prolific ransomware gang in July, behind 62 attacks, that's 10 more than the month prior, and more than twice as many as the second and third most prolific groups combined, Lockbit 3. Zero maintained their foothold as the most threatening ransomware group, the authors wrote, and one with which all organizations should aim to be aware of. Those second and third most prolific groups are Hivleak's 27 attacks and Black Basta 24 attacks. These figures represent rapid rises for each group since June, a 440% rise for Hivleaks, and a 50% rise for Black Basta. Researchers from NCC Group counted 198 successful ransomware campaigns in July up 47% from June. Sharp as that incline may be, it still falls some ways short of the high water mark set this spring, with nearly 300 such campaigns in both March and April. Well, in May, the United States government ramped up its efforts against Russian cybercrime by offering up to $15 million for prized information about Conti, then the world's foremost ransomware gang. It is likely that the threat actors that were undergoing structural changes, the authors of the report speculated, and have begun settling into their new modes of operating, resulting in their total compromises increasing in conjunction, Hivileaks and Black Basta are the result of that restructuring. As such, it appears that it has not taken long for Conta's presence to filter back into the threat landscape, albeit under a new identity.